powered DeWise uh, microphone that I'm using to film this video. It's the Video Mic Kit. And I actually got this on a rebate key rebate. But the problem is, is I had one and the 3.5 millimeter jack kept popping out. So that's not me pulling at all. That's just me turning and it pops right out. It doesn't click in. It just goes and it pops right. But yesterday there was no turning. There was no nothing. It just kind of came out on its own. I don't know if it's like, you know, that was a little pulling but not a lot of force. It's just... So this thing just doesn't stay. Like there's a little wiggle and you can see it popping out. That's just me shaking it back and forth. I'll do it again. I sent it back and then uh, they sent me another one and it seemed to be a little bit better. But I went to film the other day outside and I noticed the mic came off again. And then the like I was filming the dogs and there was no audio. But there was like a little scratch that I heard of like an audio mic input. And I think that it started to slip. So I sent them a message and I said, was this a problem? Was this ever repaired? And then I looked at the reviews and so many other people mentioned the problem. They're like, uh, the mic won't stay in the jack. You know, what do we do? So when I messaged Powered DeWise, I thought they'd be like, hey, you know, your product's out of warranty, whatever, you know, because they weren't like a, it's not like Rode or something that I know about. And even then, you know, Rode has a one year warranty. Who knows what they would have done. Um, but I ended up messaging them and they got right back to me and they were super super friendly and they sent me a couple of these um, you know just that they stand by their product and super sorry that happened and let people know what you know that they fixed it and improved it and or but now if you have one of these mics don't throw it out that thing is snug and the other ones what would happen is is just a little bit of movement or just a little bit of issues, they like wouldn't stay put in the jack. Like you can hear that click. There was no click. It would just slide out. So if you have one of these Power to Wise video mic kits, I hope you didn't throw it out. Please don't throw it out. Get in contact with them. Uh, also, you know what? I'm filming from about four feet away on a Black Magic Pocket Cinema 4K. Let me know what you think the audio sounds like. I mean, this is a test for me too. I haven't heard it. For all I know, it sounds like uh, scratchy and hissy and bad, or it could sound amazing. And I don't know, this is the size of the mic. Comes in this case that you saw me take it out of. It's uh, pretty well made. Phone holder. Another wire for using your phone, so it's like three on this side and two on this but I think it's because you know like phones if I'm not mistaken have like a video section and then go down I, I don't know I shouldn't speculate on things I'm not sure of uh, a wrench which I'm not hundred percent sure what the wrench is for I think maybe I don't know it's just a, a good bonus uh, came with a cleaning cloth oh the wrench seems like it goes to this tripod head I'm not sure what you can do I'll ask them oh it's kind of glued together but um, and then, yeah, I always love getting these, uh, screen cleaners cause you need them and sometimes they get dirty or you don't have one and you can put them in everything. Uh, I got a bike lock. I'm working on a little video for that and it came with a cleaning cloth and you know what? I'd rather have a cleaning cloth than no cleaning cloth. So thanks. Always an added bonus. Oh, how do I forget the, uh, the dead cat? They refrain from calling it a dead cat on the box. They call it a furry wind muff, which is almost inappropriate in different ways, but uh, that's an adult joke. Um, and then inside the furry muff is, oh, it's like textured in there. And then you have it right here in the fits of the mic. And then you have this mount and holder for your microphone. But I'm super stoked on that because it fits really, really good in my camera bag. So now I have one for the Black Magic at home and then I have one for the GH4 and maybe I'll have some level of continuity. Um, but yeah, they're small and they travel well and you can be the judge on if they sound good. I mean, maybe you wish they didn't work so you could get me to like shut up. 